This is a uh, south-facing window on our house here. We got a little seed starting uh, station here that we, we use. And then uh, when it's not in use, we use it for other things. Uh, we've got some shop lights here, LED shop lights. They work okay. Uh, so we started some plants. I got a bunch out in the greenhouse already. So this is, uh, my wife started some, some flowers down here. Various different types of flowers she started uh, out of some soil blocks we made. And then uh, I've got some starts here. These are uh, habanero peppers, serrano peppers, and then I got some cayenne here going. So we like to make hot sauce out of those. And then we've got uh, some asparagus back here. I don't know if we can see it, but it's kind of... I uh, started those from a seed as an experiment this year. Out of seeds I collected last year, I had 100% germination rate on those. And then what else have I got? And then uh, some sage and cilantro trying to uh, start in there. So not doing too good on the sage. So anyways, this is all going to go out to the greenhouse when they get bigger. I've started a bunch here. And we have a bunch out in the greenhouse uh, that we'll go check out here in a little bit. Okay, let's go out and uh, check out the greenhouse here and see what we got out there. It's a pretty nice day today. Blue sky. Almost time to take the RV cover off. Raised beds are going parsley, overwintered. And we got. Uh, Oh, some lettuce going in here, and then also uh, garlic over there. That's doing pretty good. Then here's the greenhouse. Let's get in here. It's a little cool this morning, but in the greenhouse, I don't have it heated or anything, but I got, uh, what do we got? 58, 56 degrees in here. And then I got a little, tub over the top of these guys and they're all sitting on uh, little heat mats that are controlled by this uh, heat mat thermostat and uh, the reason that's blinking is just because of the frequency of the my cell phone and and the 120 volt 60 cycle so that's what that that's what that is all about so in here I have let's take this off some seeds I'm trying to get germinated out here. Those, these are sweet meat uh, squash. So if you're not familiar with that, sweet meat is a it's a it's a type of Hubbard. It's really good. It's a lot sweeter, and it lasts a long time. Matter of fact, I still have two or three squash uh, out in the garage in a little pantry. So we got basil here. That we we started inside all the seed. We started inside on that shelf. Uh, these are tomatoes, uh, red robin, determinate tomatoes, uh, more basil. And then these are cucumbers. And then uh, I got a little bit, some Roma, uh, determinate tomatoes, cabbage, red cabbage. And then, uh, yeah, some Danish ball head cabbage. Anyway, so that's that's that. It's this little white tub works great. This guy right here works great to sit over here and then keep the temperature a little bit warmer, humidity going in here for the seedlings. That works pretty good. Over here, um, I just started some potatoes, some Yukon Golds, and we got blue potatoes along the back. Uh, I think those are indeterminate, so when they pop up, I'll put more soil in them. These are Yukon Golds. Uh, they're determinate, so I plant them down a little bit lower, and then that's the level the potatoes will be at, or pretty close to it. So, got them in here to get a good start. We'll move them outside when it warms up a little bit. And that is about it for the greenhouse. And over here, we got our garden area. It's a small little garden plot. I don't know if you can see them or not. There's a couple of deer 
right over here. These guys are relentless. They'll eat you out of house and home. That's why I have an electric fence here. So when we get that garden going, it, it stays on. Matter of fact, I'll turn it on. And this is a little homemade job of sorts. I had a little 12 volt uh, charger there. I had a battery sitting around, so I bought this little solar panel with a built-in uh, controller. It's pretty inexpensive. And uh, it keeps this battery charged. This thing runs all winter long, all summer, nonstop. Uh, this little guy works great to charge a little battery. So it's kind of a kind of a hillbilly looking thing there, but it works good. Berries. Uh, Patch, we've got blueberries, uh, boysenberries, marion berries, and raspberries in here. And then some more uh, marion berries over there. And we're going to probably plant a couple of different types of berries in there, small ones. And then this will get planted out. And I, unfortunately, I got some asparagus right in the middle of it here going. That's my old asparagus bed, but they're, they just keep coming back. So I'll keep those going. Anyways, that's it. We'll take some of those plants that we have up in the greenhouse, right up there, and we'll put down here in the garden when they uh, when they get big enough, it gets warm enough. And there's the deer, he just doesn't care that I'm here. Yeah, don't forget to give me a thumbs up, like, and subscribe. Really help us out. Thanks for watching. See you on the next one.